Welcome, lords and ladies, to the world of Manor Lord, where your strategic prowess will determine the fate of your medieval kingdom. Imagine lush landscapes, bustling villages, and epic battles, all that in your fingertips. Today, we are diving deep into this captivating blend of city building and really time strategy. Is it worth your gold? Let's find out together as we explore what makes Manor Lord a must play or just another title in your library. Ready your swords and shovels. Let's get started. So, what is the deal with Manor Lord, which is developed by Slavic Magic? This game is a mix of city building and really time strategy, set in a stunning medieval landscape. Seriously, the graphics is gorgeous. You will find yourself getting lost in details, from the lush fields to the intricate buildings. It really pulls you into the medieval vibes. And now, let's talk about gameplay. One of the coolest things about Manor Lord is how you get to build your own town from scratch. You are in charge of everything, laying out roads, placing buildings, and making sure your village are happy. But here is the kickers. If you forget about food protection or neglect their needs, your villagers may get a bit cranky. And trust me, an unhappy village can lead to chaos. It is super satisfying to see your hard work paying off when your settlement start thriving. And it is not just about building. There is also a military side to things. You can recruit soldiers and engage in battles, which add a nice twist to the city management aspect. The combat is not perfect yet. It still feels like it needs some polishing, but it's definitely fun. And now, let's keep it real. Manor lore is still currently in early access. That means, while there are plenty to enjoy, some features are still being worked on. Players have reported around 20 hours of gameplay before feeling like they hit a wall due to limited content. But there's a good news. The developers are super engaged with the community and are rolling out updates regularly. They are listening to the feedback, which is always a good sign for any early access title. I have been checking out what players are saying about Manor Lord, and opinions are pretty mixed with mostly positive. Many folks love the deep of the game but wish for more variety in buildings and features. Some players have mentioned that while building mechanisms are sold, they want more option for customization and also for combat. Well, it could be definitely use some added deep and strategy. If you enjoy early access game and don't mind a few rough edges here and there, this could be right up your alley. Let's talk about the money. Right now, Manor Lore is priced at $40 for an early access title that may seem a bit steep if you are not sure how much contact you will get. But if you are into medieval city builders and excited about future update, it may be worth it. Plus, many players find themselves experimenting with different strategy during her playing throw which has replay value. So, is Manor Lord worth buying? If you love immersive city building games and are okay with titles still in development, then absolutely. Just remember that there may be some limitation along the way. Overall, I think Manor Lord has a great potential. The developers' commitment to improving the game based on community feedback is promising. With the regular updates coming our way, this could become one of your favorite titles before you know it. What do you think? Have you played Manor Lord or are you thinking about giving it a shot? Let me know in the comments below if you found this video helpful or just enjoyed hanging out with me today. Don't forget to like and subscribe 
for more gaming content. Until next time, happy gaming. See you.